Hey there, home theater fans. My name is Todd with avnirvana.com. We're here live in Dallas, Texas at Cedia 2022. And I'm being joined by Rob Buddy. Hey, uh, pleasure to be here, Todd. I appreciate you coming out to see us. Yep. And we are here at JVC, by the way, as you can tell from his shirt. The keepers of the cool, I mean, you guys have been knocking it out of the park for years with your home theater projectors, and a lot of enthusiasts out there love you guys, and it looks like you're doing it again this year. Yeah, we have some great new features. We have a new firmware update we're going to release in mid-November. So with that, any of our current NZ line laser projectors, our NP5 RS1100 model, customers can download that for free and add it to their projector. And there's some great features that we're going to add into that. It's going to be the new HDR processing, which gives you a much brighter HDR image than before. Also, you have a... So that's different than before. You guys are you're adding on. We're adding on to it. So it's a whole different... It was called HDR level before. Now it's called HDR quantizer. And so it actually processes the image differently and provides a nice brighter image while still keeping uh, the same black floor. So Is that, a, is that firmware uh, customers of the NX... Five, seven, and nine. With the NX five or seven are the lamp-based models of the previous series. Okay, so this is laser only. Laser only and the NP five. So, okay. so it would be those current series that we're currently selling. So. Right, and the, what's really exciting about your current series is it is all laser, for the most part, except for the NP five. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, exactly. So, except for the entry level. Yeah. But um, some of the other features we added a, a, a HDR. Um, frame adapt HDR so we added three new levels to that so the customer has an option depending on their environment they can have the image brighter or darker okay. um, also we added a uh, third um, dynamic dimming mode so the customer will notice a nice really peak white information that will go all the way to infinite black so it's quite impressive when you listen or watch the demo next door you can definitely see it when it goes to the star scene. Wow. So the black is really getting down to infinite black. Yeah, the, the peak white information is really going to stand out, and you won't, like star scenes will just come out of the screen at you. So That's awesome. And you guys also recently launched a 25th anniversary edition model, correct? Correct. We just introduced the 25th anniversary model for our 25th year, of course. It has a nice silver chrome finish bar in the middle and on the ring around the lens which designates it so silver being 25th year that's what we went with for sure but um but with this model it's got 150,001 native contrast 3,000 lumens um $30,000 price point it'll be calibrated by Chris Deering to the customer's specification Wow, will he come out to the home, or he'll, is that remote? He'll, he'll do it remote, but once he gets the information from the customer's screen size, throw distance, he can calculate all that for that customer and, and their sources. And then we also add a nice plaque and a, a jacket that comes with it. So. A jacket, like a wearable jacket. A wearable jacket, yes. Oh. Awesome. You know, really proud of your JVC, you can show off. <laughs> yes, that sounds great. So. Um, is there anything different about it internally other than some cosmetics? The big thing is contrast ratio is going to be the big difference. So your your black floor is going to be much lower than the NZ9 model uh, in the current lineup. So. so where do we go from here now? You mean you guys have achieved laser status? Everybody's been wanting lasers. So now you have lasers. I mean, what's the next step for projectors? I think the next projector is, you know, we use a blueescent laser. Maybe the next step might be an RGB laser. So with that, we get a wider color gamut um, than, you know, in the past. But one thing with our projectors, everything starts in our simulation series and works our way down into the CI market. So we have a full line of simulation projectors that are all laser-based right now. And so all the technology like E-Shift and E-Shift X started in that market and now are working that's way down the street. And by simulation, you mean like flight simulation, flight these types of... Yeah, so we need military and commercial flight simulators as well. As well so that's pretty cool. Awesome. Well, listen, thanks for taking a few moments out of your day to uh, chat with us. Okay. And uh, I'm hoping to pop in there and see yeah, this demo. Definitely worth it. Worth the wait, so... Awesome. Okay, well, all right, folks, that's all I've got for you now. Stick around for more coverage from Cedia 2022.